ಹಾಯ್ ಅವ್ರಿವನ್ ನಾನ್ ನಿಮ್ಮ ಕನ್ನಡದ ಹುಡುಗ ಪೂವಣ್ಣ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಪೂದಿಯ ಪರ್ವ ಚಾನೆಲ್ನಿಂದ ಹೇಗಿದ್ದೀರಾ ಚೆನ್ನಾಗಿದ್ದೀರಾ ಶೆಕೆ ಹೇಗಿದೆ ಹೌಸ್ ಅ ಸಮ್ಮ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಹಾಟ್ ರೈಟ್ ವೆಲ್ ಸರ್ಟನ್ಲಿ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಹಾಟ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಗ್ಳೂರ್ ಇಸ್ ಫ್ಯೂಮ್ ಇನ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ವಿತೌಟ್ ರೈನ್ಸ್ ಬಟ್ ಎಸ್ಟೇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಮ್ಯಾಚ್ ಹ್ಯಾಡ್ ಸ್ವೆಟೆಡ್ ಅಸ್ ಹಾಟ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಇಟ್ ವಾಸ್ ಆರ್ ಸಿ ಬಿ ವರ್ಸ್ ಅ ಸಿ ಎಸ್ ಕೆ ದ ಫಿಫ್ತ್ ಮ್ಯಾಚ್ ಇಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಡನ್ ನಾವು ಬಟ್ ವೆಲ್ we expected rcb to win but sadly rcb couldn't win this game well here is the highlight of the day R- rcb won the toss and elected to field first and later on csk put up a total of 226 of 6 that was a very huge total and chasing this rcb could do around 218 for 8 which actually uh, was a very good total very good chase Uh, certainly we have to appreciate that the the total of 444 was a to, uh, no total of both the teams from the yellow brigade and the red brigade as well well that was certainly a huge huge total and this actually tells you the story of this match well coming to the positive side of the rcb well there are a couple of positive points which i wanted to discuss on this day well uh first of all we have should, should appreciate mohammed siraj who bowled four overs just considered 30 runs and one wicket he was the only bowler who could uh only concede eight runs per over and rest everyone had considered about 10 runs per over we should certainly appreciate this guy we also the bowling team had given up only minimal extras so that was a good sign from the bowlers and coming to the other part was faf duplicis batting along with glen maxwell well talking about faf he scored about 63 runs of a couple of deliveries and uh, he took the match away and now he is the orange cap holder with 215 runs topping in this tournament right now so he has been doing really well and his current form is really important for rb rcbs in the tournament you know progressing ahead well glen maxwell what a man what a match he had he just hit sixes like anything he just took 33 36 deliveries to score 76 runs well these two added on to make about 124 runs that partnership was really huge well certainly dhoni once he finished the match he actually commented if faf and vera sorry faf and maxwell were there then certainly this match would have been done within 18th over well he is true absolutely because he is coming he is a legend and he knows it the impact of these two players well certainly we have to applaud these two right so these are the positive sides of rcb okay well certainly i have to talk about the negative things which happened in this match well there are a couple of negatives which i wanted to highlight first thing is the bowlers conceded 10 runs per over only mohammed siraj was the only bowler who could reduce his economy on that but if you look into the other bowlers they had conceded 10 runs plus over which is not at all a good sign for you know as we move ahead in the tournament right so that was one negative which i wanted to highlight and next one was virat kohli's initial wicket absolutely we were stunned what happened you know it hit his foot and just went on to roll onto the stumps that actually made a big difference of this match because if virat kohli and fab would have gone trust me this match would have been well over within 70th over because the kind of form he brings in in this tournament is something we re- really we really, we have to appreciate and uh, the third thing is dinesh karthik's cameo of 28 of 16 certainly he played very attacking shots he was very aggressive he was uh, was very well determined but he lost his pace again because we call him as a finisher and that thing didn't came up from him so certainly we fans are disappointed and next up is mahipal lomra he just didn't disturb the scorers at all guys what is he doing i know he is a very good player he is potentially talented but we need some runs we need some runs in the middle order if you ask me a player like shivam dobe can do it for csk then why not mahipal as well 
you have to push it man you have to push it the reason why i tell that is because you are certainly talented and i have watched you playing the under 19 games taking the games heavy like anything i hope he comes back to form and next up is the feedbacks so certainly when we look into these matches okay especially the match with csk we have to make sure that the bowlers should concede within eight runs per over that should be the you know theme of the tournament so if they can restrict the opposition within 172 160 that will be the best thing what the bowlers can do and one more thing with the middle order should be strengthened i hope michael bracewell comes into the middle order instead of dinesh karthik and moreover as i earlier told maxwell has been good in coming in at number three and taking the game away but who is there to support the later order so i hope michael bracewell comes in and just you know takes the game away so certainly these are the two feedbacks which i wanted to give and apart from that uh, there are a couple of things like the turning point of this game the turning point of this game was uh, you know dinesh karthik's wicket at a crucial 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 time he just went on to make 28 runs of 16 balls but couldn't finish the game man you are talented i understand you are still you are still a legend we still admire you with whatever you have done to the indian team but we need a little bit more a little bit more because we need those victories because as the tournament progresses these victory matters those two points are so crucial it's like gold guys certainly i hope it's the same with the rcb fans over there as well and let me talk to you on this so where do you put in josh hazelwood i i know he has come back he's in a good form but where do you fit him in it's up to the team management to decide on his uh, you know progress as well in this tournament let's hope we have a fabulous tournament ahead so the next gap, next game is again uh, against the P uh, punjab super kings so i'll come back with yet another review on the same and i know that all the fans are disappointed yesterday but don't lose hope guys rcb will come back and they will certainly come back they are our team we will keep cheering them saying rcb 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 and that breaks a lot of heart in you and the team out there so we have to be with them in the good times and also in the bad times that's what fans are all about we are the 12th man right so we have to keep cheering them we have to keep pushing them hard and make sure we get more and more victories in the games to come all the best guys for the days ahead please subscribe please like please share your comments and we are uh, no we'll bring you much more better videos in coming days thank you and have a great day bye guys